Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be speaking English for 24 hours. As you guys know, I'm from Honduras and I moved to the US six years ago, so I should be able to do this challenge. So if you do hear something that doesn't make sense, do not judge me because English is my second language. What am I gonna be doing today? I do have class tonight. So right now it's five o'clock if you did not know my major is fashion design so right now I'm working on my final project of course I'm gonna show you that this is actually a real challenge because I don't really speak English that much not even with two of my siblings because they speak English all the time but I'm always speaking Spanish to them let me tell you a little bit about me where do I start I do not have that many friends I actually don't have friends but that's okay though I don't know if I don't know you that well I'm not gonna talk to you. I just don't know what to say you know I do talk to some people and we're just hi how are you yeah it's nice to see you yeah bye I'm gonna show you an example of my conversation hey how are you hi did you do your homework yeah I did you yeah. yeah I did so oh, good I just don't know what to say I guess that people think that I'm shy or that I am creída I don't know how to say creída. Let's look it up. Like if you really get to know me and I get to know you, I cannot shut my mouth. So this challenge is a really, really good way to practice English because I'm basically having a whole conversation with you guys. But anyways, let's move on and let me show you what I am doing for my final project. Okay, so this is a dress I'm working on. It'll be a black dress and a cape. I'm gonna show you all the process and the finished garment on a separate video. I don't, I don't really think you can see Okay, I'm gonna put it on the floor, okay? So you can appreciate my masterpiece. I'm not gonna show you that much because like I said, I'm gonna make another video. So let's focus on the 24 hour challenge. Okay guys, so here I am, I'm headed to school right now. I wish I had a really nice um, cart mount, but I don't. This is the one I have and it doesn't hold my phone. Mm -mm. It doesn't hold it okay so i think my phone is too heavy and by the way i'm sweating my ac doesn't work that is the sad truth of being poor okay so i just got out of school i'm going home now and i am so so happy because next week the 17th is the last day of class i really need some free time so since i'm not taking any summer classes i think i'll be uploading two times a week so what i usually do when i'm driving is to listen to gospel music and also listen to predicas i don't know if you remember but one of my goals for this year was was is to read the bible every single day except sundays and i do it every morning because if i don't do it in the morning i don't do it it is it is beautiful i really encourage you to read the bible you will learn a lot a lot of things okay so i'll see you when i get home probably or tomorrow <laughs> Love of the Lord gonna fill you up, yeah So what's I gonna be now? Him and you crazy Time to take time, say spirit and soul free Why don't you just guess? Don't make your life a mess He'll take care of the rest Good morning guys, so it is 9 a.m. I already took a shower, I read the Bible. I used to work at Boost Mobile, so that's with the shirt. But anyways, as you can see in the back, I have a mess. So let's do something about it. here too here we have a pattern i want to make me one of those i like this one the most so let me tell you a little bit about these right here these are supposed to be for candles but i was like you know what i need something to put my brushes in i saw these little i think these are like for a christmas tree <laughs> But uh, I really like them, so I bought them and this is what I did. I have this toilet paper here because I need it all the time, like to clean my little thingy, to do my eyebrows, you know, you know, and things like that. This 
this is how it looks it doesn't look that clean because i'm being too lazy anyways i don't have that many stuff here because i just have like my basics here like my foundation my concealer my eyebrow thing my um sponge sponge my sponge my blush my bronzer um highlighter and my powder and my brushes and that's that's all i need i'm pretty basic right yeah okay now i have to prepare for a presentation my final presentation i have on monday i'm gonna presenting on the crinoline period and it is actually really interesting it talks about the civil war uh, the invention of the first sewing machine and it talks about the gold rush and the um origins of the levi's let me read to you a little bit about history of the levi's in the united states so women still lived under many legal and social restrictions they had no legal control over property they locked the vote in the late as 1850s 50 some states allowed a husband to beat his wife with a reasonable instrument can you believe that wow that's crazy i want to show you the type of garments they wore back then So these are the hairstyles in the hairdress, the hair, <laughs> the headdresses. <laughs> the period I like the most is the Empire period. Um, see, this is nice. Even for men. I need to study, I need to prepare for my presentation, but first coffee. Con pan. Hondureño que se respeta, toma café con pan todos los días. I'm sorry if I look I'm high, but I'm not. It is 12 p.m. now and I have not eaten anything. What I ate was bread and coffee. When I want to lose weight, I fast. I don't eat anything until 12 or 11. I just do it when I can't control my mouth. You know, sometimes I'll be eating all the time. Like right now, I'm so stressed out with this fun. Hey guys, so here I am again. As you can see, I did my hair and I also did my makeup. Um, it is almost five o'clock so i really hope that you enjoyed this video as you can see i don't really do much so i hope you find it interesting so yeah this is it for today as always thank you very much for watching and if you have any suggestions please make sure you leave them down below in the comments and as always do not forget to subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next video bye bye